Yo, what's up YouTube and welcome back to another FIFA 22 video. Now, today's video is long-term investments which can make you absolute millions of coins if you time it at the correct time. Now, we're going to be talking about club stocking and prepping for league SBCs because it is that time of the year where they're going to drop a couple league SBCs. Now, if you're new to FIFA guys or new to the SBC sort of section, you'll know that they drop top leagues as well as some other leagues. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to pick up the players that are not in packs that often. And while the market's completely low, okay, we're going to be buying them at minimum price. So this here is a perfect way to be buying the correct card at the correct price at the correct time. And if you do all three of those correct, you're going to make millions of coins. So if you're new around here, guys, hit that sub button. Uh, turn on the notification bell and let's see if we can get 100 likes in the first 24 hours on this video as well If we do I will upload a second video of this sort of type guys Explaining more and going into greater detail and a few extra methods that are going to make us more money If you don't hit that like button you guys are packing absolute zero You shouldn't do the SBCs anyway then because you won't get nothing So let's talk about this guy So the SBC section is a great way to invest and make money into the future of the game for yourself to build the better team now again let's go straight over to the SBCs. as you can see the live ones are normally a good way to kind of invest in them if you already know what's coming like this chris niardo ronaldo uh we we kind of invested in that and we made some good money the benzema again if you checked out last week's video these two were coming we invested we made good money However, they will upload a league SBC. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to go into the major leagues. So, I will show you on the PC in a second how to work it out as well by yourself, guys. So, you can find your own cards and kind of go from there. So, obviously, the top leagues, okay, is the Premier League, uh, La Liga, Liga 1, Serie A, Bundesliga. Now, they're the top five. Uh, I would put Everdees in there as well as a very good uh, sort of method. Uh, sorry, very good league and the championship. Okay, now obviously championship here. These players are going for some money at the moment. Well, sorry, they're going for no money. But we all know that these cards can jump from 200 coins up to about six to 7,000 coins. Now you can determine which cards do that by hopping over to the PC, which is what we're going to do right now. So as you can see here, guys, okay, I've brought up this little web page. Now this is a website called Footwiz absolutely amazing hands down also footbin is great again now how i found out what leagues were dropped last week without uh, sorry last year without completely forgetting any is i just went onto footbin and went into the, the fifa 21 section and we check out these here so as you can see cards like for the csl for xbox was 526,000 to complete this and you got a prime gold players at the pack. You get packs out of each club. Which I prefer than when they used to give us players. Okay. Because players weren't always good. It gives us something to grind towards. The same as this one here. Okay. Now let's go and have a look at these little uh, league centers. As you see 205,000. Uh, the Premier League was 170,000. So as you see there is coins to be made. Now what we're doing here. Okay. Is we're going to search for the league. So we're going to go into the Premier League. And you're going to pick cards that are not coming up in packs as often, guys, okay? Uh, and, that, and when I mean that, you want to be picking up basically the four main card types, which is gold commons, okay? Because not a lot of people open uh, and get gold common packs. Uh, gold rares obviously are quite common, but they're so low right now. This is why we're doing this video right now. But silvers, silvers are so so hard to get because no one really sits there and opens silver packs you'll get them in like the sbcs or you'll get them when people do a little bit worse in uh squad battles or you know foot champs or something like that they'll get some silvers in their packs and these are the ones that are going to jump up now as you can see over here guys the english premier league has 344 gold cards in okay it has 161 silvers and 118 bonzes now these bonzes here okay in this are going to go oh let's go uh bonds are gonna go from 750 coins probably upwards of two to three thousand coins now all these adverts do get annoying uh but we want to be picking up at least the cheaper ones guys okay and then to isn't guarantee more profit we want to be looking at right backs left backs right mids left mids center backs and goalkeepers now the reason we do that Okay, is because those positions do require 
those cards. You can normally stick a cam in a center mid or a CDM in a uh, center mid or, you know, a striker to, you can convert it. But if you don't have all four corners, okay, the right mid, left mid, left back, right back, and the goalkeeper, it's very, very hard to complete with the, the chemistry. So these are the sort of cards that we will go for. Uh, on top of that, you do want to look at leagues, okay? So nation, not nations, teams that only have one right back or one left back or one left mid, you know, one of that position because that will make that card is more valuable, okay? So let's go and check out another one. So with the silver, guys, the MOS is going to be high for silvers. Are you going to pop up? You're not going to pop up, eh? uh okay right <laughs> let's go and check the championship so there you go championship two championship two actually has uh 400 and something 475 silvers so this is going to be a great place to be hitting up those silvers guys so again let's go uh items and silvers now as you can see these silvers are down at 450 on PlayStation, Xbox, you're at 1K, okay? So you guys do have a little bit more to spend, but that's because it's always been a little bit more expensive on the PlayStation, uh, but uh, so on the Xbox. So you guys have got the same method, you just gotta pay more, you will make more, I promise, okay? Because obviously more people are going for those cards, especially cards like this here, 3.7, only 650 on the, uh, on the PlayStation. So I'm hopefully trying to get you guys into these. Now, again, what we're gonna do, Okay, is we're gonna just club stock it. We're gonna put them in our in our club and we're gonna sell when they're in demand. So right now they're absolutely low, which is why we're picking them up. When say the championship comes out and you require uh, 11 Bournemouth players, okay, but it gives you a 35K pack, that is gonna roughly cost you about 25 to 30K to build. Sometimes it can even cost you upwards of about 50 to 60,000 for a rubbish pack, but because when you complete the whole league, you get a bigger pack. Uh, people will pay that sort of money. So these cards will completely go and you'll be looking at your club when you've bought them for 350 or min price or, you know, maybe 600 coins. Uh, you're going to be selling them on for about you know, four, five, six times your money, guys. If not more, depending on how much you pick them up. If you pick them up for 350 coins and you can sell them on for 8,000, that's pretty much 12, uh, 20 times your money. Sorry, 20 times your money on one card. Great investment, and it's just it's just thinking business. So, the leagues that you want to be going for right now, okay? Obviously the top five, but like I said as well. So we do have these ones here, okay? The Liberators, okay? I can't remember if those cards are in here. Yes, they are. So there you go, Liberators, okay? Now these normally come up in leagues as well. So maybe pick up some of the cheap right backs and center backs and left backs and goalkeepers and just work around that league, okay? And then go into the CSL, the MOS, La Liga BBVA. That's another good one. Any, any league that really requires a lot of silvers, guys, because that's what we're gonna be working on um, right now because, you know, <laughs> Because they're not, they're not there. They're not, they're not being packed. So they're going to be low now. Then no one needs them. The silver market's completely dead at this moment in time. Right. Okay. So here we go. Right. So we're going to start off with the championship, guys. Okay. And we're going to go and hit up some of the silvers. Now, let's find out what silvers we can get. We're just going to flick that over. If you don't know how to get it to all silvers, guys, all you need to do is right twice and that will take you to the silvers. Okay, now let's go through each and every club real quick. So let's have a quick look what we're looking at here. We're looking at about 400 coins uh, for the minimum of these. So we're going to hit up the goalkeeper, okay, as a start. Now, if you can pick them up on open bid, guys, and you can get one or two of, of let's say they've got two keepers, then definitely pick them up. Now, again, I wouldn't do this if you've got a low amount of coins right now. However, if you do have four, five, 600K, which I do have about 650K plus, uh, you know, probably another 400K invested. Uh, this would be a great method to just, you know, pick up as many as you can. So as you can see, uh, we're going to see how many keepers are in the Bournemouth team, which I believe is just one. 
Beautiful. So we're just going to go and pick one of these up. So 350 coins is what we saw. Can I pick them up on an open bid? I can potentially get them there for 250. The lower, the better, guys. You're okay. You're just going to make money non-stop all the time. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go into the right back position for them. Okay, there we go. And let's have a little look what we're getting now. Uh, 400 coins. Again, looking smart. Can I pick them up a little bit cheaper? I could potentially get them there for 150 coins. So I'm going to put a bid on him there. Okay, so you understand you don't want to be buying when they're a little bit higher. You want to buy it as cheap as you can. Now, centre-backs are naturally going to cost more, guys. Uh, so just bear that in mind. Don't be put off because you see uh, centre-backs going for a lot more than what they should be. Uh, now, I'm going to pick them up for 300 coins on that one. And again, on this one, let's go 350. And I can pick him up there for about 500, so I probably won't get him. Let's quickly have a look how many centre-backs they've got. So they've got one, two. Uh, they've got just two, is it? I feel like there's just two. I can't see any others. Yeah, so there's only two in this one. Normally, some teams will have three or four. Definitely, definitely pick them all up, guys. And also, remember, if they have a gold, okay, just make sure you're picking up the gold version as well. Because, um, yeah, this is... It's just literally that simple, guys. Again, we're going to go to the left back and so on. Let's, again, let's go 350, 400. So we can go 400 on this guy here. I might actually just buy him out right there just so we got one. Uh, again, you could potentially just knock that away and see what you can pick up here. So you've got some bronzes here that you could use. Again, if you can pick these up for 150 coins to 200 coins, you will make absolutely insane money just with that method as well, guys. Okay? So actually, I advise you probably to go fully to uh, to those. Just not not putting it on one. Just put it on all of them so every single card comes up. And then just buy the absolute cheapest. So as you see, the right mids here. Okay. It might not have right mids. Okay. So right mids. Yeah. So they're going to have a right wing by the look of it. Let's go and check the, quickly check the wing. Don't get caught on that, guys. Because some people do convert it down. And then you spend loads. As you can see here. Uh, yeah, he's, he's about 350 coins. So we're going to go and pick him up there for 400. Nope. Okay, I can probably get him for 350. Um, let's go there, there, and to that. Minus score pick up. Boom. Uh, and what they've done is they've changed him to a right mid and tried to make more money. It's a different sniping method or trading method that is in my channel. So go and check that out as well. Uh, right, okay. So I've done that one there. So what you do now is you go into the next one, okay, and you start again. Now, it does take some time, guys, but making millions of coins doesn't just come overnight, okay? You do have to put in a little bit of effort to find out. So, here we go. 350 coins for the keeper. I reckon I can pick him up for 150 coins, guys, okay? Again, the right mid position. As you can see, I'm only doing the defensive line. You could do the oh what am i doing right back you could do the whole lot i mean i would if i had a little bit of time right now but just for the sake of the video i'm doing the defensive line for you guys so this guy they don't have a right back which now is going to make me feel like they have quite a few center backs it's going to probably be a three at the back and as you can see there is some here guys now i'm going to pick him up for 150 coins again i almost bought him for 200 because i was being lazy don't be lazy just buy them or bid on them, okay? Uh, let's go and have a little look what else we can pick up here. 250 coins. Now, again, there's only ones, only one bronze by the look of it. And two silvers. So, one, two, three silvers, four silvers. Okay, so there's four silver centre-backs here. Uh, and one bronze. So, there you go. So, there's four centre-backs. Again, let's go and have a little look what we can pick up silver-wise. Flick it over to silver, so we're only picking those up now. And as you can see here, okay, so we've got this guy here. I'm going to try and pick up for 200 coins. Uh, I've got this guy here that we will try and pick up for 350 coins. I think that's a minimum yet because it's silver rare. Uh, again, with this one here, 300 coins. Let's get you as well. And then where's the other guy? One, two. Oh, was it the 72? I think it was the 72, wasn't it? Yeah, I didn't do him. Uh, da, 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 da. So it looks like there we go. There's a 300 again. Boom. So that's all four centre backs. And so now that team there is going to be pretty hard to go for, guys, when it comes out because you know there's quite a lot of centre backs. Let's again get into the left back position 450 coins, 600. Okay. 
Okay, there will be no left back will there because I've just explained there's four centre backs. Um, so they'll, you'll have to kind of maybe look at their formation and see what you can get away with. So one more guys. Again, we'll go for like Fulham. Now we know Fulham has gold players. Okay. How many gold players? I don't know. Um, oh, have I got it set on tonight? No, I haven't. So again, let's go over to gold. Okay, they don't have... That was on left back, that's why. <laughs> what a one back. So as you can see, they've got quite a few of them, guys. Uh, you want to be definitely picking these cards up right now while the market is so friggin' low. It's insane. Okay, but again, as I said, you want to be picking up maybe bronzes as well. What bronzes do we have floating around? We have quite a few. So, yeah, that is pretty much what you want to do. And then you want to go through every single league and do it. It will take you a couple hours. Uh, but the more, let's say you can pick up three right backs, four centre backs, three left backs, three right right mids, three left mids, and so on. When that card goes pretty much extinct, guys, it's 30k for the right back. It's 30k for the left back. That's 30k for the centre backs. That's 90k possibly made from, you know, nine cards. And you've only spent about 3k picking them up because you picked them up today. Uh, so, guys, don't forget, hit that like button, hit that sub button. I will be making another trading video that will make you more money again today. This is more of an investment video and uh, I'll be uploading that later tonight. So take care. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.